This summer, I tried Starbucks sweet cream iced coffee for the first time and I was surprised by how good it was. It's not overly sweet and the way the sweet cream blends with the iced coffee is really delicious. Okay, let's dive in. First, let me show you how to make cold foam. Starbucks uses non-fat milk to make their cold foam, and I'll admit that low-fat milk does foam up really nicely. But I prefer a little more creaminess in my coffee drink, so I'm willing to sacrifice foaminess for creaminess, which is why I recommend using whole milk to make your cold foam. Here's the side-by-side -side comparison of the quality of the froth using 1% milk versus whole milk, and what they look like five minutes after frothing. Okay, place four tablespoons or one quarter cup of cold milk into a glass or small measuring cup. Add one tablespoon of pure maple syrup and a few drops of vanilla extract. Feel free to substitute vanilla syrup for the sweetener if you have that on hand. Now whip the milk mixture with a handheld milk frother until it's nice and foamy. If you don't own a handheld milk frother, this can also be accomplished with a traditional blender or an immersion blender. Now scoop that over your cold brew or iced coffee and you have a delicious foamy cold coffee drink. So that's how you make the cold foam. Now let's move on to the sweet cream. Starbucks sweet cream is a blend of cream, milk, and sweetener that's whipped until it's somewhat thickened, but not so thick that it won't mix with the coffee. It kind of has the consistency of lightly whipped cream. It's a pretty brilliant invention in my opinion because it adds a lovely creaminess and froth to the iced coffee, but it mixes with the coffee better than traditional whipped cream. To make vanilla sweet cream at home, place three tablespoons of heavy cream in a glass or small measuring cup. Add one tablespoon of whole milk, one tablespoon of pure maple syrup, and a few drops of vanilla extract. Whip this mixture with a handheld milk frother until it thickens slightly and increases in volume. Resist the urge to whip it too much, otherwise it will be too thick and it will just sit on top of your coffee instead of mixing with the drink. Now again, this can be accomplished with a blender or an immersion blender. Now pour it on top of your coffee and watch the magic happen. Isn't that just mesmerizing? It's so, so easy to add that salted caramel flavor to the vanilla sweet cream. Just add a pinch of sea salt to the vanilla sweet cream recipe before you whip it. This is my personal favorite of the four recipes because I'm a sucker for that blend of salty and sweet. Okay, let's finish off with a DIY version of the Starbucks pumpkin sweet cream. Now I went and ordered a Starbucks pumpkin sweet cream for research purposes and not gonna lie, I didn't like it. It honestly tasted a little bit fake, a little bit chemically. My homemade version is so much better. Skip Starbucks and make this instead. Start out the same way as the classic vanilla sweet cream. Place three tablespoons of cream, one tablespoon of milk, one tablespoon of maple syrup, and a few drops of vanilla extract in a glass or small measuring cup. Now add 1 8 teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice blend, a pinch of salt, and one teaspoon of pumpkin puree. The pumpkin puree is optional, but it does enhance the flavor and it gives the sweet cream a little more color. The salt is also optional, but the Starbucks version did taste a little bit salty to me. Now whip it all together until it's slightly thickened and pour it on top of your coffee. I really like the fall spices in this one. It's a lovely way to celebrate the season when you don't want to give up your iced coffee just yet. So that's four ways to make cold foam or sweet cream at home. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and make sure to check out this video next to learn eight ways to froth milk for your homemade lattes without owning an espresso machine. For the maple syrup and vanilla extract, and vanilla extract, resist the herb, Starbucks sweet cream. My cat is climbing the wall.